well. First, all you say is beautiful in itself. So thank you. It's extraordinary. Um, I don't know if I have an answer to your question because I no one ever had asked me that question before. I guess um, I have no problem with sharing what I love. I think that to me, learning the tarot has been literally learning a language. In a sense, I think, you know, I, I, I love the circus. Now that's not politically correct to say, but I love the circus. And I love the circus because the circus function is pretty much very similar to drawing. When you are looking, you know, at, at the tree ring circus, there is what we can say is the, the, the main image that is being formed the guy in the trapeze, the elephant jumping, or the lion jumping. And then, with the corner of your eye, you can see all these other things happen. People taking uh, material away, people setting up the next uh, act. In the same way that when you draw, you trace these lines, which are the main lines, but at the same time you see the other lines that you used to, to build the drawing, or the lines that you decided, this, this is not the direction I want to go. So in the, in the tarot, you have this idea of a language, uh, that speaks all these um, poetic tropes and in a sense it speaks that thing that I have been kind of chasing for a few years now that is called the language of the birds or the, the, the gay science, the Gaia Ciencia. And the nice thing is that in language that's also there. As you say, you, you can take a word and break it apart like if it, was, it is an egg and you find a lot of other words inside. But we forgot how to do that because we use words all the time. That's why Goethe says, you know, uh, words are uh, dead metaphors. And um, now I've been thinking that it, maybe images are dead metaphors because we are forgetting how to break them apart to, to find new images inside. I think that Tarot still shows the remnant of how that was done, of how that is done. So I'm very interested in learning how to do that and trying to figure it out. And I would love to share that with more people, certainly. 